Good morning children. How are you all? Welcome to Max class. Children, today we are going to start term 3. Children, name the 2D shapes that you have learned. Yes, square, rectangle, triangle, circle. Let us recall the properties of 2D shapes. Square. Square has four sides, four corners and two diagonals. All the four sides are equal. Rectangle. Rectangle has four sides, four corners and two diagonals. Its opposite sides are equal. Triangle. Triangle has three sides and three corners. Its sides may or may not be equal. Circle. Circle has no sides, no corners, no edges. It is a closed curve. Children, today we are going to learn Unit 1 Geometry. In Geometry, we are going to see straight and curved lines and properties of 3D shapes. Straight line. A straight line is just a line with no curves. Which means a line that extends both sides till infinity. It is a straight line. Curved line. A line that is not straight is a curved line. Which means a point does not move in one direction. It is a curved line. Children, let us draw the shapes similar to the shapes given in the dotted grid and sort them by writing C for shapes made of curved lines. S for shapes made of straight lines and CS for shapes with both curved and straight lines. Let us identify the shapes. Here we have only straight lines. So write yes. Second one also we have straight lines. So write yes. Third one straight lines. Yes. Fourth one straight line and curved line. So CS. Next, curved lines. Write C. Next, straight lines with curved lines. So, CS. Next, straight lines with curved. At the corner we have small curves. So, CS. Next, straight lines and curved lines. CS. Next, straight lines. Yes. Next, straight lines and curved lines. CS. Here, curved lines. So, C. Next, curved lines. Write C. Children, let us draw the shapes in each category. First, we have curved lines. Ball. Next, straight lines. Next, curved lines and straight lines. Next, diagonal. Diagonal is the line joining 
opposite corners of a geometrical shape. Let us see the diagonal of square. Square has 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 corners. Diagonal is joining the opposite corner. 1, 2. There are 2 diagonals in a square. The line joining opposite corners of a square is called diagonals of the square. Let us see the diagonals of a cube. A cube has 6 square faces. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. 6 square faces. Each square has two diagonals. Square has two diagonals. So, 6 into 2. 6 twos are 12. Plus, inner side of a cube has four diagonals. 12 plus 4 equal to 16 diagonals. Cube has 16 diagonals. Six phases and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight corners. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve edges. Match the properties of 2D shapes by observing the sides and corners. First one, opposite sides are equal. The options are A. Circle. Circle has no sides and no corners. B. Triangle. Triangle has three sides. Its sides may or may not be equal. C. Square. Square has four sides. All the four sides are equal. D. Rectangle. Rectangle has four sides. Its opposite sides are equal. So, first one answer is D. Rectangle. Second one, there are no sides and corners. The options are A. Circle. Circle as yes, no sides and no corners. So, the answer is A. Third one, sides may or may not be equal. The options are children. Remaining options we have B and C. B is triangle. Triangle has Three sides, its size may or may not be equal. So, the answer is B. Fourth one, all the four sides are equal. The remaining option is C. In C, we have square. Square has four sides, four corners and all the four sides are equal. So, the answer is C. First one, opposite sides are equal. It is D, rectangle. Second one, there are no sides and corners. The answer is A, circle. Third one, sides may or may not be equal. The answer is B, triangle. Fourth one, all the four sides are equal. The answer is C. Square. Complete the table by counting the sides, corners and diagonals of the given 3D shapes. Children, we learned the sides, corners and diagonals of cube. Tell me children, how many sides are there in a cube? Yes, six sides.
which is six square faces. How many edges are there in a cube? Yes, there are twelve edges. Next, corners. How many corners are there in a cube? Yes, there are eight corners. Children, tell me the number of diagonals in a cube. Yes, sixteen diagonals. Next, cuboid. Cuboid is also has the same properties of cube. The sides of cuboid is six. Edges of cuboid is twelve. Corners of cuboid is eight, and diagonals of cuboid is sixteen. Next, cylinder. Cylinder has one, two, three, three sides. It has no edges, no corners, and no diagonals. Next, cone. Cone has no sides, no edges. No diagonals. It has one corner. Next, spear. Spear has no sides, no edges, no corners, and no diagonals. Children, observe the things in the classroom and identify whether it is curved surface or. flat surface or curved and flat surfaces tube light curved and flat surface fan curved and flat surface windows flat surface notice board flat surface table flat surface benches flat surface next pick up the shapes with curved surfaces flat surfaces curved and flat surfaces from the given picture and complete the table children observe the picture it is a classroom first we have curved surface children tell me the things that are in curved shape Yes, wall clock. Next, flat surface. Tell me the pictures in straight lines. Yes, board, table, desk, chair, duster, etc. Next, curved and flat surface. Children, observe the picture. Tell me the things that are in straight and curved lines. Yes, water bottle, globe, chalk purse, etc. Tangrams, a traditional Chinese puzzle made of a square divided into seven pieces. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven pieces. One parallelogram, one square, and five triangles that can be arranged to match particular designs. We can make figures of animals, people, and many things using these seven pieces. Children, let us arrange some things using these. Seven pieces. It is a fish. Tangram rocket.
टेन ग्राम हॉस टेन ग्राम हाउस टेन ग्राम बोट टेन ग्राम स्वैन tessellation a tessellation is created when a shape is repeated over and over again covering a plane without any gap or overlap children when you fit individual tiles together with no gap or overlap to fill a flat space you have a tiled floor we have already learned that few shapes such as triangles squares hexagon tile on a plane while few figures such as pentagons heptagons do not tessellate on a plane complete the shapes by filling the tiles next draw one more tile to continue the pattern thank you children